Hey YouTube, TechLink9 here once again guys, and today's tech tip how to guide is going to be how to back up your contacts, your um your text, your app data all at once so whenever you flash to a new ROM it'll all be there easily, you can get it back easily. So let's get started. The first app you're gonna be using is Titanium Backup. And um I just want to tell you it's a very easy process and uh, very easy to do and um, I just want to tell you that you have to have root access to uh, be using these so um, just be aware of that if you don't know how to root and uh, you do use a Samsung Galaxy S2 like this phone this phone is a Samsung Galaxy S2 T98 phone I will have a link in the description on how to root your phone so after you got that done you're gonna be in Titanium Backup it's a free app just choose the free one it's alright <coughs> And um, let's say I want to root or I want to back up Temple Run, right? Because I'm going to be flashing to your new ROM, right? So you just do this tap up and back up. It's very simple and uh, super easy to do. It only takes a few seconds to Temple Run. And um, well, this is a kind of big file, so it, it will take a little bit. But if you have a smaller file, then you'll be good to go. And um, if you do like to back up things, um, I would just recommend you back up um applications that you get from the Google Play Store and not from the stock apps because you can have them when you uh, flash to new ROM usually so um, I just got it backed up right and let's say oh blah 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 okay I flashed to new ROM right so I just installed the team back up again and um, I just want to advise you um, the data will be backed up onto your external SD card right external so if you flash and use dark side super wipe it will not be uh, erased because it's external it will not touch it Alright, so you just go back into there, and uh, you uh, you don't have to install uh, Temple Run again. You just tap on it. It'll be here. Just tap on it, and um, you will have um, you will have um, restore right here. You just want to tap on there, and it'll, it will ask you data, Apple New or App and Data. Just tap App and Data if you don't have Temple Run already installed, or you can just do it. I always do tap App and Data, and it'll restore it. Uh, very easy and it only takes a few seconds alright and uh, install was black because I already have temple run installed or whatever also, but if you don't have it installed then you won't have any problems alright so um, that's how you restore any of your app data alright so anything from the google play store they installed and you have like maybe like a drawing on there or something that you from an app like that it'll back it up it'll back every single thing up including data and app from titanium backup very easy and free to do <coughs> Next one is um how to back up your text messages, right? Because um you know maybe if you have a phone number that you you don't have um in your contacts, or maybe you just want to keep the conversation because it's important to you, you know. Uh, you're gonna be opening up SMS backup. All these are free, all right? Completely free from the Google Play Store. So you're gonna tap, you're gonna open up SS SMS backup, and here you got options. It's very basic to use. Anyone can try it. You got backup, restore, view, search, delete backup, and delete messages. So, um, if you just want to backup everything, you just want to tap on backup. It'll ask you, um, to save the file name. What do you want to save it as? You want to click OK, and after this, it'll tell you everything, right? And then this uh, warning sign will tell you that it's backed up on your internal SD card, not external, internal. So, if you flash to a new ROM, it will be deleted. So, before you flash to a new ROM, you should transfer that file into your external SD card and you'll be good to go alright warning warning alright guys so um that's how you back it up see it's a very quick video and they um this uh, SMS backup does have ads unfortunately but if you want to get rid of ads um I do have I'll have a link in the description how to get rid of ads it's another video too I have it's an ad free app so just get rid of any um ad in any apps at all alright guys I'm sorry about the cutoff and uh, this is the last way for uh, if you want to back up your contacts, so you just want to open up your uh, default contacts, um, contacts app, stock app, app or whatever, for whatever uh, ROM you have, and you would go to options. And um, there are several ways. This is why this is my favorite because there are two ways to do it, which are really great. So you want to go to import export, and you want to export it to your storage. Um, it will give you the name of the file. Just gonna click OK, and um, this will uh, export it very um, easily and very quickly to your external SD card, so you don't have to worry about dark side swipe. It will not touch it at all. 
so then when you're done flashing or whatever you can just import it back on and the next way is actually um, my favorite because it deals with just uh, Google and their servers it doesn't even touch your phone at all so all you're going to be doing is going into contacts you want to go to account as long as you have a Google account which you should because you have the Google Play Store and all that which is really unnecessary to have any fun on your phone <laughs> Uh, you'll be on here, right? You want to tap on your uh, account name, and um, you just want to make sure uh, sync contacts is checkmarked, and then um, you want to do sync now, and it will sync all your contacts that you have, even if it's on a SIM card, it's on, it was from your SD card. It will sync all those contacts onto the Google Cloud, so whenever you come back, you flash or whatever, you flash back on. You just log into the Google account, and it will um, have it back on all your contacts, every single one on, into your contacts uh, application and that is what I do every time I flash because I flash a lot for you guys you know that and that is what you get guys thanks for watching guys don't forget to rate comment or subscribe and hopefully this is uh, very helpful for you guys if you're uh, very new to uh, Android or you just don't want to re really research or anything um, this is a really great way to um, find out how to all do all these things and uh, check out my other videos if you want to find more useful tips like these thanks guys